So hello everybody, welcome to that presentation. What I actually have is B26 RF2K Plus, and it's named a PA a little bit different. Why? We're gonna come later to that. So this is a list of the features, the key features we got in there. There are many more and a lot of scenes behind, so you can later step by the booth and we're going to have a, as many questions as you want. So, it's a short wave HF 1.8 to 30 meg with 2 kilowatt and this is choose power at, five, at 50 meg or 6 meter. It has an excellent signal quality and I got it on the brochure, so everybody wants the brochure, we hand it out later on. Signal quality goes up to 46, 45 dB which I think it's a very good number. So it's got one antenna input, for output, no SO2 in there, but like I said, we get a special feature called SO2R Plus. Somebody mentioned that, it's not my invention. We can buy two for one. So you see, a power building power meter, one watt up to three kilowatt, very quiet, so you can really run it in your shack without being destroyed by any kind of fan. So we all know that power amplifier usually going to be a noisy thing, but it's not at all. So uh, PA runs really quiet, all fans, interfaces. So we were thinking of what kind of interfaces we're going to need. Okay, definitely we need to have a cut interface. So, and we then thought, okay, cut this might be not everything. There's the future. Everything is LAN connected. So we get LAN connection. So on top, the, the boards we're gonna use, and we're using a Raspberry Pi, we got even Wi-Fi in. So for contest setup, wherever you are, so the, the amplifier may stay somewhere, but you don't have any LAN connection. Now you're gonna control the amplifier. Yeah? So we do it just through Wi-Fi. Use a tablet, thing like that. You see it in a picture here. Just any tablet, smartphone, you can control the amplifier. So, whatever you think of. IP controlled, CAT controlled, through the internet, or even local network, that's all built in. And we got a measuring output as well, pseudo DBM, well, which is good for any measurements, but most of the guys using it for previous source. So it works like a charm without any external sampling and all that yaddy yaddy we need usually to using for example an anon with the breeding source. It's just an SME plug, fit it back, all done. Okay you know, seven inch touch screen. So I guess I will, this was the first amplifier in the world with a touch screen on when I started inventing it about three years ago. And right out, right today, everybody has a touch screen. So it's just a nice, very clean touch screen with all the information on you need. It's not overloaded, everything at the place it should be. It's got automatic frequency sensing, all that stuff, and so you can use whatever gear you have got, even an old 9060 amp, a TRX, it will work. So, fan sensing, building antenna tuner, once you've been stored the values for a particular frequency, changing frequency, click there, you can go. 100% remote control, that's what a lot of hams already using, they got remote stations out there, and they're using it. And they'd be happy. So, software update, and that's coming to software, that's why I said a PA a little bit different. And Tim, he gave this PA even a, another name. He said, this is a software-defined amplifier. <laughs> so we're not gonna have just software-defined radios. Everything can be done by software. So many features in. We got a lot of feedback from the users and good feedback. So, well, good idea, let's build it in. So that's all in, so what, that's why Tim calls it a software-defined amplifier, just a little chub. So, and there's an optional automatic antenna tuning. So input power versus output power, 0.5 watt gets you up to the kilowatt. 
We all know, uh-oh, that's out of the 15 dB. But it's a kit. You won't get it working for me. Yep, you can define it all itself. And it makes two kilowatt plus minus 0.5 dB. So that's all about much more in here. But we are over there at 4.3710. So everybody steps by gets more information. Thank you. Whenever everybody would like to get a brochure, raise your hand, Mark is gonna hand it out. Thank you.